Alright, now that bluey month has come and gone, we can get back to our regularly scheduled theories about various topics. As requested by Sonic the Beast here on YouTube, we're doing another Spongebob theory today. If y'all are interested, go ahead and request theories or topics you want me to cover in the comments, and I'll try to cover any requests in a timely manner and drop a shout-out in the video, as long as they're, you know, appropriate for YouTube. Also, make sure to subscribe to the channel if this is something you enjoy. Now, let's talk Spongebob once more. I think Squidward is dead. That's right, just gonna hit you with that right off the bat. Squidward is dead, and I'm not referring to the creepypasta of that word that YouTube doesn't want me to say. Hear me out. In Season 3, Episode 2, Club Spongebob, Spongebob, Squidward, and Patrick get launched into the kelp forest where they become trapped. Spongebob and Patrick have a talking conch shell toy they call the Magic Conch, where they ask it yes or no questions and it answers, kind of like a magic eight ball. Well, hijinks ensue when the Magic Conch seemingly grants Spongebob's and Patrick's wishes for food and rescue, but Squidward doesn't believe in it. By the end of the episode, however, Squidward becomes more and more desperate for the conch's approval to eat since Spongebob and Patrick will not let him partake in the meal dropped before them without the conch's approval. The conch denies Squidward's requests at every turn, however. So, the conch clearly does have some sort of magical properties, but here's where it gets weird. At one point, Squidward runs off into the woods, thinking that he'll eventually find his way out. He runs in a straight path. We see the path. But when he emerges, he's on the opposite side of the clearing that he just left. Well, I think this is when Squidward dies. He passed away lost in the woods, and the conch, aka the godlike deity of this universe, ushered his spirit back. From this point onward, Squidward is trapped in purgatory. He can't find happiness and move on until he learns to accept and cherish those around him. Until he passes his tests in the form of Spongebob's and Patrick's antics. The closest he came to hell was that noose joke. By the end of the episode, they did not make it out of the forest. Also something to consider, they never made it out. So, the show will continue until Squidward accepts this and learns to become a better person. The show isn't about Spongebob's story of fun antics. It's the story of Squidward's journey to the afterlife of his choosing. But leave your thoughts and theories in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe.